coastal region, the Kenya Ports Authority has unveiled a new safe house for gender-based violence survivors in Lemo County, which was built at a cost of 6 million Kenya shillings. The unveiling comes in the wake of increase in cases of gender-based violence in Lamu and other coastal areas. Nicole Monza with the story. Gender-based violence has become a thorn in the flesh of many households in the country. The increase comes in the wake of financial difficulties due to high cost of living and the effect of COVID-19. The safe house in Lamu was constructed at Mokoe Hospital in Hindi area, which has the highest cases of GBV cases in the country. Yeah, we have a nice Speaking during the official handing over of the facility, Lamu Women Representative Rueda Muhammad said that the facility will help gender-based violence survivors have a safe place to stay while seeking justice. Nika ita mkutano wa mapiesi, piesi wa, wa Kenya nzima. Nika fanya mkutano, nililipa 400,000 intercontinental hotel. Nika sema njoni, nika jana idea. Nika sema, acha sisi tuchange, tutengeze safe house, kisha hii safe house, tuite Maria Malmawi. Rueda said that the project will help victims get medical care quickly, first aid, counseling and ensure that the evidence is not lost, noting that GBV cases are many but normally the suspects are not jailed because of lack of evidence, adding that now they have engaged village elders, chiefs, police and the entire community in ensuring justice prevails. Sasa hapa hii umjengo utatusaidia, mwanzo utapata eh, medical care, haraka haraka, ya upesi, first aid, na pia counseling, Na ingine ni vipi watahifadhi ile ushahidi. Mfano kama ni mtoto ya mekua rept, hapa daktari atamujulisha immediately kwamba huu, hufai kueka hivi, hufai kuoga, hufai kufanya hivi, ndo kenda kotini patikana ushahidi. Cases ni nyingi mnambiwa, lakini zikenda kotini hakuna. Haifiki mwisho usiki mtu kama mefungwa kwa sababu ushahidi unakosekana. Sasa hii hapa itasaidia waze wa mta, tumewahusisha waze wa mta, itasaidia polisi, itasaidia machifu, wanashida, Itasaidia sote kwa jamii wote kwa jumla. Amina Bunu from the Department of Health in Lamu County Government thanked KPA for coming up with the project of the rescue center, which will serve women whose rights have been violated and other cases of gender-based violence among children. So I'm sure we are going to use it. Let's uh, to see when a facility yenye hatu taitumia. Sawa, tuko na facility yenye tahudumia wa mama ili wawe safe wale ambao wamekuwa violated ama the gender based violent cases sawa sawa watoto ili wakiwekwa hapo wako salama si unaona imeitwa nini safe house si sawa ama safe place Muntaz Abdul Rahim a resident of Mokowi said that they were happy to see the project being opened in Hindi for GBV victims who have suffered for a long time and had difficulties in getting justice adding that there is also need to come up with a safe house for men as some are suffering in the county Sasa jengo kama hili limejengwa pia tumefurahi pia na wao watakuwa wako kwenye stara watapata msaada tumeshukuru sana na madhumuni yetu pia Tumeomba pia sisi tupate pia nafasi ya ajira ya kazi. Pia pagine kutokuwa na nasisi pia tutapata nafasi ya kazi. Tuwasaidie wao hapa. Mwana kama wavlana vengine lamu na sikia uwapia ubako wanaume pia. Pia na wao pia wasiji wakali ya vifu pia pia wao taka kujengiva majumba yao pia jamaa. For the longest time, gender-based survivors in Lamu County have yearned to get help and justice, and the building will help the victims, particularly in the area where defilement and rape cases are high.